threw Javier Fortuna up there is he is somebody who has power, somebody who has a lot of experience, and is going to have a big opportunity to prove himself in this fight. He's currently a top 10 uh, lightweight. Like, people be shitting on Fortuna like this is an easy, easy, easy win for for uh, uh, Ryan Garcia. And I don't see it like that. Like, I, listen, I'm a Ryan Garcia fan. And, look, I'm picking him to win. I'm picking Ryan Garcia to win. But I, I, I'm aware that Javier Fortuna can crack. I'm aware that Javier Fortuna got power. I'm aware that Javier Fortuna puts people to sleep with one shot. The same shit y'all talk about Ryan Garcia. Javier Fortuna could do the same shit. That's what I'm saying. I, I'm picking Ryan to win. Don't get me wrong. But if this question's about that chin, oh, trust me. Trust me. Javier Fortuna will put those knuckles right to the fucking test. He's going to put that shit right to the test. If, 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 it, if he has a weak chin and Fortuna lands one clean, he's going out. I, I, I don't think he's going to land one clean. I think Ryan's going to be defensively responsible enough. I think that he uh, uh, is just, honestly, just on speed advantage, he can he can knock out uh, uh, Fortuna. But again, Fortuna's the puncher, and he's an awkward fighter at two. He's a southpaw. He, sometimes he boxes a little bit more. Sometimes he comes in a little bit aggressive. So Ryan Garcia is not going to know what to figure out. And, and I heard Ryan Garcia saying, like, oh, I expect him to come right at me. He's an offensive fighter. He's this knockout artist. And I'm like, I don't think he knows that Fortuna can box too. I'm not saying he's the best boxer. I'm not saying he's the best boxer. But, um, you know, he, he could box. 